Hi, Brian Davenport here, and welcome to another episode of On the Vice. Today, I'll be tying for you a Dave Whitlock Red Fox Squirrel Nymph. Try and say that three times real fast. So for a hook, I have a 2X long, size 14 nymph hook. Now these can be tied in sizes 2 through 18. And for thread, I'm going to go ahead and I am using Simperfly Wood Duck Colored in 8 watt. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to lay a thread base down here. Just a little bit back. And we want 10. 10 wraps of 0.015 wire. I'm going to do this a little different here. Show you a little trick. That's going to break right there. And I'm using this on the Norvice, but you can use tie these flies on any static vice. One, two, three, four, five. 10. There we go. Pop that off. Now we can go ahead and take our thread, finish dressing our hook. If you're using a Norvice, that's just a whole lot easier way of securing that wire down. So for our tail, this original pattern calls for uh, Tufts of hair from a red squirrel's back and belly. I don't have a full red fox squirrel hide, so I'm going to go ahead and just use pieces of a red fox squirrel tail. So let me go ahead. And we want that about the length of the shank. So I'll do a pinch wrap and we'll secure that in. And that's it. You can pull it back to adjust for the side for the length. With this being squirrel tail, I'm if I can get it all to cooperate. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it down all the way up towards the eye just to make sure we have it in there and it doesn't pull out. All right, we'll cut that off. And for a rib, we are going to use some Simperfly. 0.01 gold wire. Go ahead and we'll tie that in. Be careful when you go backwards not to mess up your tail. Alrighty. Now for the abdomen. We are going to use Dave Whitlock's SLF dubbing, synthetic dubbing. And in this uh, box, we have red squirrel abdomen. And we're just going to go ahead and we're going to dub just finger dub this get that tightened up a little bit All right. 
half hitch there. We're going to go ahead and we're going to spin our rib on there. Give it a little bit of segmentation. Kind of help the fly hold together just a skosh bit. All right. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to get some more of the Dave Whitlock SLF dubbing. And this one is the Thorax. And if you buy these in the packages, you go to look at for them. It actually says, I think, number one is for the thorax. Number two is for the abdomen. And it actually says thorax and abdomen on it. That's not what we wanted to do. Yeah, it is. And we'll go ahead and wrap that down. I don't like the way that's sitting. I'll get that off there. Try it again. I have used this fly on several occasions, and it has definitely earns a spot in the box. that in and we're going to go ahead and do whip finish right there now if you're going to tie this in anything larger than a size 12 then you can go ahead and put on dark ginger hen hackle for legs, but for anything smaller than a 12, I don't fool with it. You can get your uh, little brush and brush it out to make it look more boogie. Then I don't have my brush here with me, but that's okay. You get the general idea. There we go. Break my thumb over it a little bit. There we go. If you get a, a little brush and brushed it out, that would look a whole lot more buggier. So thank you for joining us for an episode, another episode of On the Fly brought to you by Hackles and Hurls Fly Fishing. If you find this content valuable, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Click the bell so that you can receive notifications of future content. We'd love to hear feedback from you, so drop us a comment below, questions, comments, or give us some suggestions for future videos you'd like to see. Also, we provide custom orders, so either drop us a DM on social media or go to our website, www.hacklesandhurls.com, and let us know what you're interested in. We can tie it up for you. Thank you, and have a good day.